Hello everybody, I'm Ben Foster. Welcome to another Cycling GK video. It's Saturday morning, Cov City at home, match day. Chicken, pesto, ketchup. Thanks, big dog. See you later, Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Cheers, buzz. Go on, man. What a turnaround. Well done, mate. Boys have just bailed me out like crazy. Here's that. Well done, mate. Hello everybody, I'm Ben Foster. Welcome to another Cycling GK video. It's Saturday morning, Cov City at home, match day. Great result Wednesday night against Stoke City 3-2. If we can win today, we can potentially go second in the league. And there's an international break after this as well. So that'd be two weeks we'd spend at number two in the league, which is a great feeling. So if we can get the win today, go into the international break, higher confidence, buzzing our trees off. Let's have it, come on the boys. So guess where we are again? Hotel, standard. It's a bit weird as well though, because it's locked down, there's no other guests at all in the place. So we're literally the only people staying here. And you don't see anybody, you don't hear anybody. It's weirdly quiet. What a view though, look at this. I'll tell you what, this looks like it's gonna be a good day to play some football. And like I say, it's international break, so there won't be no games for two more weeks. So what I'm gonna do instead, we're gonna have plenty of videos from the training ground, plenty of cycling videos, probably plenty of Will swearing as per usual. It's always gonna be fun though. We're gonna have a laugh, keep you guys entertained, get you through this rubbish, rubbish lockdown. I'm gonna go get some breakfast, a coffee. Let's go. Oh, first coffee of the day is always the best coffee of the day. That is lovely. Mm. What the jump, man? How did you not scare? Right, pretty much. Chicken, pesto, ketchup. Still have to go in for team meeting. First things first though, just whooping his ass at countdown. As usual, match time, on the way to the stadium. Big game, Cov City. Andre Gray back in the starting lineup today after a little injury. Starting to get some of the big dogs back. Here's the main man. Come on the bars, you big Thanks big dog. See you later mate. Cheers mate. Cheers buzz. Good luck. Good morning. What a day for it. Boy, silly. 
There you go, you're on, mate. Yes. <laughs> I'll give you it in a minute, all right? You're a ledge, mate. Whoa. Boys have just bailed me out like crazy. That first goal definitely should have saved it. Fire, though. Lads were on fire, seriously. Troy D came on with about 10 minutes to go. He was a joke. Well done, lads. Well done, lads. You know where, well done. Is it all right? Yeah, of course you can. Well done, boys. Well done, mate. Bravo, lad. Beautiful. Well done, Well done, lad. Well done. Well done, boy. Sorry, lads. Well done, boys. That's what you've been season. You were well done, lads. Hey, brilliant, brilliant. Go on then boys. Okay, so 3-2 in the end. Great win by the lads. They did really, really well. 1-0 um, up, 1-all, 2-1 down, and then 2-all, and then an Ismail Saar penalty won it for us. I said a few weeks ago that this league is so difficult to predict, and fair play to Cobb. I thought they were actually really good today. I think they'll be all right this season. Um, but we found a way to win today, and that's the most important thing. I think that takes us up to second or third, going into the international break. 
absolutely buzzing. And I've got to say again, thank you, lads, for, for helping me out because that first goal I definitely should have saved. I cannot get beat from a header from anybody from about 30 yards, which happened today. One of those things, though, that's the life of a goalkeeper, not the end of the world. I'm going to go home now. I've got two days off. I cannot wait. I'm 100% going out on my bike. Looking forward to it. Stay safe, everybody. See you all soon. Bye-bye.